Winona Ryder, the talented actress known for her iconic roles in Beetlejuice, Edward Scissorhands, and Stranger Things, has captivated audiences with her unique blend of vulnerability and strength. However, her path to stardom was far from easy. Winona's early life was marked by challenges that could have easily derailed her dreams. Ryder was born in 1971 in Winona, Minnesota, and grew up in a family of seven children. Her parents, Michael and Cynthia Horowitz, were both writers and editors who valued art and creativity. Ryder's parents, Michael and Cynthia Horowitz, were hippies who lived a bohemian lifestyle, often moving from one commune to another. This unstable environment made it difficult for Ryder and her six siblings to maintain a sense of normalcy. The family relied on food stamps and lived in tents and teepees, struggling to make ends meet. Winona also didn't have an education because her parents prioritized creative expression over formal education, leaving her without a traditional schooling experience. Despite the difficulties, Ryder's parents encouraged her love for acting, and she began performing in local theater productions at the age of 12. Her talent and dedication earned her a scholarship to the prestigious American Conservatory Theater in San Francisco, where she honed her craft and landed her first film role in Lucas, 1986. Ryder's early success was soon followed by a string of critically acclaimed performances in Beetlejuice in 1988 and Heathers in 1989. Her unique blend of quirky charm and deep emotional depth captured the attention of audiences and critics alike. However, her rapid rise to fame was accompanied by personal struggles. In 2001, she was arrested for shoplifting at a Beverly Hills department store, leading to a highly publicized trial and community service sentence. In that same year, her struggle with anxiety and depression came to light for which she blames her unconventional upbringing and the pressure to succeed. Winona also grappled with personal challenges that were often published in the media, relationship issues, as well as battles with addiction. It was rumored that Winona was addicted to prescription painkillers that she usually obtained using various disguises and prescriptions from different doctors. This was also shortly after her shoplifting stint, she was, however, not convicted of any drug charges. After taking a 10-year break from the screens following her shoplifting arrest, Ryder continued to push forward, using her role in the Black Swan to spring forth back into the limelight. She also used her experiences to inform her performances and connect with her audience on a deeper level. Her portrayal of Joyce Byers in Stranger Things 2016 to 2022, earned her widespread acclaim and a new generation of fans. Winona Ryder's life has been marked by a series of challenges that have tested her. From a rocky childhood to struggles with fame and personal issues, Ryder has faced numerous obstacles that have shaped her into the strong and talented actress she is today. Throughout her journey, Ryder has remained true to her roots using her platform to advocate for social justice and environmental causes. Her resilience and determination serve as a testament to the power of the human spirit, inspiring countless young actors and artists to pursue their dreams, no matter the obstacles.